Man, cloak and daggers. We're not far now. Gwyn Whitehill may already be there. What is this? Our ironwood trees. It's the Whitehills. You see what they've done? This track was hundreds of years old. And they reduced it to nothing. We've no time to waste. We must take back what's ours before all the ironwood is gone. Aye. The White Hills need to answer for this. And Gwyn needs to answer for this. But we need to find out what she knows. She'll be over there. Be cautious, my lord. If she go around her father to help us, she must have some purpose. She's taken a risk in meeting me. Let me hear what she has to say before I judge her reasons. Of course. Just be wary. You see what her family's done here. Here. You might want this. You may have known each other since you were children. But this could be a trap. Doesn't hurt to be careful. That's true. Go on. I'll stay with the horses. I didn't take anything that would bite me in the ass, huh? We'll find out. It's not enough to take our wood. It must defile our homes. Else. Cutting down everything they see. Do they understand nothing about Ironwood? Split beams, cracked wheels, shoddy workmanship. Clearly white hill. Well, I remember hiding down there, playing monsters and maidens with little Naaman and, and uh, Megan. Hmm, <laughs> I can still smell the sawdust. <laughs> Hear the whining of the grindstone. Such a part of my early years. So long ago. I see you haven't lost your warrior's ways. That's good. I wouldn't want to deal with someone careless. Hello, Gwyn. It's... It's been so long since we've met, Roderick. It has. It was before your father found out about you and Asher. Before he stormed Ironrath. You saw my father's work over there, didn't you? And he won't stop. He means to do that to every inch of your land. I have to stop this. It can't go on. I know. You have to trust me. I don't agree with my father's ways. <sighs> I wasn't sure you were even going to show. We're taking a risk, meeting like this. Unfortunately, it's the way it has to be. Did you bring anyone with you? Of course not. So we're alone? No one even knows I'm here. I think we can help each other. But first, I... I've heard news of Asher. That he plans to return to Ironrath. Why is he coming back? 
I loved him once. I longed for Asher to come back. But not like this. How do you know about my brother? That's... part of why I'm here. But I need to know you've come for the same reasons I have. I want peace between our families. No more wars. No more bloodshed. Is that what you want too? I need to hear you say it, Roderick. Will you work with me to bring an end to this war? I want to know the price before I agree to pay it. I'm no fool. It seems that you are, because you clearly don't understand. Peace is the only hope your family has. My father is just waiting for an excuse to attack. Why do you think he sent my brother? So there will be trouble. My father will bring utter ruin on your house. Unless... you let Griff feel like he's in control. Just like you kissed my father's ring. You must show the same respect to Griff. I'll put on a good face and let him think whatever he likes, if that's what I have to do. It is. My lord, a band of riders approach from the north. Seven hells. My father's guards must be tracking me. If they catch us here, they'll kill you. Then we've no time to waste. Let's get on with it. My father is planning to make a move against your family. I don't know all the details, but he's been sending a great deal of gold to someone in King's Landing. I fear for your family, Roderick. You may think you've nothing more to lose. He is ready to show you otherwise. Why are you telling me all this? Is it meant to frighten me? To make me bend the knee and bow my no, head? No, of course not. Although that's what my father wants. And he knows you can't fight him. He knows yeah, exactly obviously. how weak you are. What? How? Because you have a traitor in your council. Someone who knows every detail of your circumstances. My father boasts of it, and I've heard some of the reports. You must tell me. Who is it? I don't know. We know you're planning to rescue Ryan. Even if it means abandoning your home to Griff. What? The My father's guards are close. I need to know you'll do what I've asked. Promise me you'll submit to Griff. If you want peace between our families, it's the only way. You have my word, Gwyn. I'll do my part. Thank you. I really don't think he would my lord, want to keep further killing we have to go. people. What I told you. Be careful what you do with it. And remember, I'll hear about it if you don't. My lord? Come along, Duncan. So much Game of Thrones. In the end, we're gonna get him. Mother. I think so. Roderick. Look at what's become of our house. You were nowhere to be found and they just... Oh, they are vile men. Where were you? We need you here. To hold this house together. Mother, I... I believe we have an ally in House Whitehill, and I've learned we face grave dangers. But... Wh what... What did this ally tell you? Lord Whitehill is plotting against us. I don't know his plans, but I fear them. And the only way he'll stop is if we submit to Griff's rule of our house. What? Would you really give up control of our house? Griff is already a torment. How much worse could it get? I have to keep the peace with Griff. Even if that means letting him have his way at times. The thought of it makes me ill. I, I don't like it either. Was this all? Did you learn anything more? You need to tell me. 
Enough with the mysteries, my son. Is it not bad enough for you already? It's bad enough having their soldiers in our house. Uh... But if you won't be open with me, then our problems run deeper. <laughs> Go on. Go on. Get in Oi, there. Lordy, then. Get in there. You do what you're told. <laughs> no, please, <laughs> no, I'm just a wee boy. No, Donny was standing over there. No, he, he fucking was. No, no, stay no, put and stay no, upside. No. <laughs> Get, Get down there. Off again. <laughs> Get down there and die. Hey, like a good <laughs> 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 what do you want from me? No, no, it was over there. And Ramsay was I'll here. Play it how I want. You will bend the knee to your liege lord. I must speak true. I haven't the balls to defy you, lord. What is this? What are you bastards doing? Oh, look here. It's the new lord. You're in luck. We're just getting to the best part. <laughs> Little Lord Ethan's final breath. Unless you want to play the Lord of House Forester instead. You can't do this. You can't do this. Get out of our house right now. <laughs> we'll do as we please. Besides, we're not finished. You must stop. I know you've seen it before, but um, it gets better every time. You want to play? Yeah, we want to play. Give me the knife. No, no, that won't do. If you won't be Ethan, you'll just have to watch and see how it's done. <laughs> oh, please, no! Say hello to your father. Oh, no, Ethan! <laughs> oh, damn it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well done, well done. I'd say, I'd say, I'd say he died better than the real Ethan. Oh, yeah. oh, better than the real Ethan. What about you, eh? You want to be next? Men without honor are lower than dogs. <laughs> I'd be happy to dirty my blade with your blood. You should have seen it. Your brother, he acted like a true lord. Right up to the moment Bolton's bastard put that knife in I don't want to strike. Before this is over, your blood will join my brothers on that floor. So I hope this was all worth it. It'll be worth it when I pull this blade from your neck and see the life drain out your eyes. Make his That's mother watch. No more now we'll really have some fun. Enough. Griff will deal with him. When he's done, he'll own this fucking house. And he'll have more than just words for you. Take your boy out of here while you still can. Roderick. Roderick. Now is not the time. Wendell, pack the extra rations. Duff, make sure the quivers are full and the torches are dry. Garrod. What's happening? We're heading north of the wall to deliver justice to brothers turned traitor. They're hiding in the woods at a place called Craster's Keep. I've been looking for volunteers. The cowards murdered Commander Mormon. We're going to kill every one of them. Who else volunteered? Cotter and Finn offered their sword. And so did Brit. He took his vows in the set. He's a brother now. I understand why you hate him. But bad blood could jeopardize this mission. Too many unknowns out there. I can't have my own men killing each other. I'm a ranger now. I've left my past behind me. Brit included. Until you're standing next to him with a sword in your hand. 
That's the real test. If you do come, I need to know there won't be any trouble. Even if he provokes you. And no more talk of the North Grove, either. Can I count on you? I need your word, Garrett. I'll be taking a chance. I understand. You won't have any trouble from me. I'll hold you to that. It's a hard road to Crestus. We leave tomorrow at first light. Now why don't you go talk to those two? And make sure they're ready. Dorf! Where are my arrows? Well, what did Jon Snow say? I don't think he likes us much. Definitely doesn't like you, Finn. Haven't heard him singing your praises, any. He wants to see us work together. No more problems. That's on you. Point is, he doesn't want any problems with either of you on this Craster's mission. Well, there's something you should know, then. <laughs> I, uh, borrowed this from you. <laughs> what? I just got curious. Oh, I wanted to know why your uncle was here. It never ends with you. Oh, didn't mean no harm, honest. I just wanted a quick look. I wasn't stealing. You can't keep doing that, Cotter. Next time, ask. Well, I did try. And you, you just said your uncle was here about Ironwood. But I think it was something else. I noticed this part here. North Grove. That's just some shit story for little kids. A rumor. No, it's not. Of course it is. I had it a witch's den where they turned children into giants. Garrett, you don't actually take it seriously, do you? It's a fairy tale. For idiots. Everyone knows that. Didn't think you were that gullible. You're wrong, Finn. It's more than a rumor. Lord Forrester found the truth, it's real. And this says it's somewhere in the north. On the other side of the wall. And here I thought you might have some brains, Garrett. To deserve each other. Have fun chasing your tails. Good. Didn't need him anyway. What do you mean? Finn doesn't know about the mammoths or White Walkers. Don't know how to sneak past a giant. What, and you do? But you know, it's the things you hear about. The rumors is all. I wouldn't know myself. <laughs> how could I? Rumors my ass. You're hiding something, Cotter. I'm not. They're just things I hear around Castle Black's all. People talk, you know. Not about the North Grove, they don't. Would you do? Probably heard you talking about it. Or, or maybe one of the recruits. I don't know. Well, it doesn't matter. It was nothing. Cotter, I know you're lying. I covered for you. You owe me. All right. All right. I've been on the other side of the wall, Garrett. You see, I, I live there. In the north. I'm part of the free oh. folk. Okay. People round here call wildlings. Oh boy. I know. I know it's crazy. I, I was with some other free folk. We were looking for weapons south of the wall. We got caught. So, so I passed myself off as a local and, well, well, they sentenced me here to Castle Black for stealing. I shouldn't be here. This isn't my place. I didn't know what else to do. Are you putting me on, Cotter? I wouldn't joke about that. They'd kill me if they found out. Are we... We still friends? I mean... I know it's a lot to take in. And I'd understand if you were angry. Don't worry. Bloodthirsty wildling or not, we're still brothers. That is good to hear. <laughs> At least when Mance Raider wants to boil you alive, you'll know someone in high places. Cotter! What did I say? That shit house you fixed is still leaking. I'll be right there. I'm going back home. No matter what, Garrett. I've heard stories. 
Old tales of a secret forest within a forest. Your lord knew what he was talking about. You know where the North Grove is? No, but I'll help you find it. I'm deserting anyway, heading back home. I can guide you, keep you alive. Mm. Stick with me and I'll show you the way. Plenty of things out there when I kill you. Others want to eat you. I don't understand. Why would you want to help me? The North Grove has nothing to do with you. I've got my own reasons for going. Fair enough. Her now! I'm on the way! Please, don't tell anyone about me. Well, the watch had killed me if they would. found out. I don't think he would. All got secrets. Secrets. Would you look at the size of this army? Seems the Targaryen girl may take the city soon enough. We'll find Croft here somewhere. <sighs> You're right. <sighs> no, it fucking hurts, Asher. And I've been through shit. Sliced, stabbed, beaten, had my face clawed off. But this... bloody dragon. <laughs> well, at least you don't smell half as bad as you did a day ago. I'll go and find this Croft. Look, Asha. Back in that cave. What happened? It was him or me, right? You must have thought only one of us was making it out. It's not fair to ask. I know. It's fucking brutal. But... There you go. There was no time to think. My uncle was just the one closest. Right. Fuck. I just... I thought... Forget it. It doesn't matter. This is stupid. I'm so sorry. Look, I am. You're my friend. My partner. My sister. I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> That's horse shit, little brother. You're going home. I understand. Your house. Your family. But there's nothing for me with you in Westeros. I'll help you get your army, and then I'm done. Beska! I, I don't Asha. understand. I know where Croft is. This Croft, how well do you know him? Too, Too well. well. I thought you said you were friends. Yeah, we are. We are. Great friends. Asha fucking Forrester! Son of a poxy whore! You have some balls walking into my tent after all these years with that mama's monkey grin on your face. Well, that went well. Great friends indeed. All right, maybe I deserve that. That's not even a taste of what you deserve. You never understood consequences, Asher. One stupid mistake cost me an eye. But you never learn. You figured you'd steal from me and I'd just forgive you? <sighs> Not a fucking chance! So how are you going to pay me back? Your eye? Your hand? Or how about your tongue? Croft, no! Be reasonable! I am reasonable! I'm letting him fucking choose! Look, Croft. What we did was wrong. I'm sorry for that. You heard him, now let him go! You're not getting out of this with a fucking apology. Croft, I deserve your anger as much as Asha. Don't worry, Beska. You're next. Now choose, or I slice off your balls, Asha. Hey, a hey, hey! A man betrays my trust. There's a Stop price this. Let him go! Enough! No more fucking about! Fuck you, Croft! Have it your way. You didn't need your testicles anyway. <laughs> Oh, that was bloody beautiful. Fucking Asher. You were pale as a oh. snow bear's ass. Oh. <laughs> are, you, are you fucking joking? You bloody bastard. <laughs> this is why people steal your shit and take off in the night. Come on, you assholes. 
Have a drink. <laughs> Joden, the Khaleesi's best wine. Your friend has an interesting sense of humor. So what uh, in seven yep. hells are you two doing here on the arse end of the earth, eh? You're a long way from young guy. We have a proposition for you. We? You're hardly the usual rabble these two travel with. He's Asher's family. That I would not have guessed. We need an army, Croft. My home back in Westeros is under siege. We need your hellhounds. A hundred good men. Am I in a hobby's tip? Would I ever go back to Westeros? I've got it good right here. Her grace pays good coin. I've got wine! Women! We can pay. I always knew your pockets were lines of gold. And I will happily take it from you. But it's not up to me. The second sons are sworn to Daenerys Targaryen. I've laid my sword at her feet. For now. Mm. Perhaps we could talk to her. She's a little busy right now, commanding a fucking siege. Her enemies are nailing children up on posts for a hundred miles. And a bloody dragon's gone missing. <laughs> but I know where to find her dragon. Ha! <laughs> Unfucking likely. You expect me to believe you've just happened to have seen the one fucking dragon loose in the world? Orange eyes, as big as my head. Scales all black. That doesn't prove anything. Enough of this nonsense. We're done here, Asher. Beska, show him. A dragon did that. So you rolled over into the bloody campfire in your sleep. Croft, I've seen her dragon. <sighs> oh, bugger me with a bloody spear. If you're lying about this, it'll cost more than your balls. Fair enough. Come on, you son of a bitch. The beast's name is Drogon. You'll okay. want to hear about him right away. And don't think you're going to charm her with that fucking Asher grin. Yeah. <laughs>